Happy Thumbs Gaming. We shall. Hey everybody, it's Jeremy from Happy Thumbs Gaming. Today we're going to show you how to get fast materials in ambition mode for Dynasty Warriors 8. This is a viewer request video. Somebody was asking for this, so here we go. Uh, in ambition mode, first thing, do not max out your merchant. Do not, do not bring it to level 50 because as soon as you do that, your exchange rate for weapon materials goes to 1 to 1 from 2 to 1. Why? I don't know, but don't do it. Uh, the things you want to level up is your barracks, your farm, and your stable, and bring your merchant up, but just don't bring them all the way to 50. Uh, these are going to be your max returns for getting materials. Uh, you can send uh, your troops out. I recommend using the bottom one because it's going to give you a bunch of uh, weapon materials which you're going to be able to switch for a 2 to 1 ratio. Uh, the one I was just trying to use is a good one if you're trying to farm money because you're going to get an elephant every time and that is uh, worth a lot of loot. Right here is a stable. You're going to feed them some honey, some nuts, whatever. You know, I like to feed them some honey roasted nuts and then they level up. They give me some animal that I can sell for loot and then they're going to give me some facility materials. Just checking in on the uh, person being babysitted over here. And this is where you can also get another good chunk of materials is from the uh, person you put in charge of the farm. If you notice that they're not giving you materials after about three turns, just switch them out with somebody. And I've also been noticing that if they have a high bond with uh, your character, then you for some reason seem to get a better ratio. So just put somebody in that's got a maxed out bond. Just keep switching them back and forth. Uh, here's where I was talking about the uh, switching back and forth thing. So uh, you can exchange it, and if you don't max that out, that'll be a 2 to 1 ratio. So if you have 20 weapon materials, now you have 40, and you can see how fast you can level this up. So uh, right now I'm just selling a couple animals. That way I can get the money for them. And bam, I'm just going to go ahead and use these materials to start maxing out the, uh, the last thing here. But like I said, max out your barracks, your farm, and your stable, and then wait... Wait, wait, wait to do your merchant or it's really going to uh, nip you in the butt. Alright, so you think that just doing a bunch of uh, missions is going to be the fastest way to do it. No, you're going to want to use your little village to get you your stuff. So go down to the bottom left one, do the material one, race to the end, slay the main dude, and then go right back to camp and then just go through that whole circle I did all over again. And that's when you get the max returns. Like you're gonna get, you're gonna max out your camp pretty fast. And then you can also use this uh, trick to uh, get yourself a lot of weapon materials if you're trying to synthesize weapons and you know get, you know, uh, maxed out skills, which is I think level 10. This guy, by the way, I don't know what it is, but he's one of my new favorites. This stupid flying sword thing is a intimidating. Two, he talks a little flamboyant. Th three, like a thousand stab mushu. Ah! I don't know. Brings out the nerd to me. But yeah, pose for the camera. Also, just for a quick little tidbit, anytime the victory screen shows up in ambition mode, you can hit X right away and it goes right to the next screen. So go ahead and save yourself that time. Like I said, don't go to the next battle. Just go ahead and return to camp. Now that you're in camp, you're going to do that same circle all over again, going from the barracks to the stable, over to the farm. You know, Sao Sao keeps juking me out, so I switch him out with Shao Hudun. Switching my materials over putting it towards the camp, running back out, doing one battle, coming back. So as you can see, this is pretty quick, pretty fast, and before you know it, you'll have your little, you know, Dynasty Warriors Farmville Village just kind of maxed out. I got red hair equipped too, just because it's the fastest horse, so it's just going to get me to the guy that I need to smash in the face with a bunch of swords a lot quicker. Zushu looks like he should be in Dynasty Warriors. Nope, he looks like he should be in Assassin's Creed, but his attacks are pretty awesome. So, you know, Shao Hudun juked me on the materials, but, you know, it happens. Everybody's leveling up. Almost got this bad boy maxed out. Also, when you max out everything in your village, you're going to get the hairier uh, animal. And if you've been doing things right, that should be the last animal. If you've already uh, followed my other video to get all the uh, mounts. And that will give you the animal collector trophy. Uh, you can also just go online. We have that on our channel if you're trying to do that. Hell, we got a lot of Dynasty Warriors 8 videos. So here we are coming back. You can see that like to bring it up through the 40s, it only took like three outings. Bam, just feeding some horses, getting some materials and supplies. And you can see here finally by switching out the characters, this guy is going to give me uh, some materials, which is obviously going to make this a lot faster. Boom. Give me some gold. Boom. Now I'm going to run over here to this guy and then just go ahead and do the exchange. Like I said, I know I'm beating a dead horse here, a dead red hair horse, but do not max out your merchant or is this gonna take twice as long. And the golden panda, you get that for getting the emperor to visit, just in case you're wondering. 
Like I said, this is all in another video we've posted. And here it is, maxed out. Boom. And then the Emperor's like, Oh, thank you, ATG, for making all these videos. All the other ones are in Chinese. Like, I know, man. we got some love for Dynasty Warriors over here in the States. No worries. And that'll pretty much wrap it up. And like I said, this trophy that's about to pop is the Animal Collector one. So thank you guys for choosing Happy Thumbs Gaming. Check out our channel for more Dynasty Warriors 8 videos. Uh, if you're trying to find us on YouTube, just put HTG at the end of your search, and we'll show up at the top. Uh, follow us on Twitter and Facebook. Check out our webpage. Booyah kashow. And as always, happy hunt gamers. That's right. You better level up, you little chick, because I'm going to take you into battle. Oh.